Well, first of all, of course, I'm deeply uh, honored and humbled um, to be the recipient of the Weldon Award. It's a prestigious award from a prestigious law school, and I'm grateful to those individuals who nominated me for the award. Education at, at a broad level um, can be transformative in one's life. And I've had many uh, experiences in my life overall which have been transformational. But one of the key transformative experiences was my time at the Schulich School of Law. It opened my eyes. It was a portal to um, discovering, exploring, and uh, equipping myself with the instruments to have a purposeful life. The law school is really in the vanguard with respect to the access program uh, for Indigenous and Black students. It was one of the first in the country and I'm very proud of that initiative when it was started and how it has advanced and grown over the years, producing such wonderful graduates. Uh, but apart from that, providing them with the support, um, which I didn't have when I was in law school, but the support which really assures them of success while studying law. We're really taught at the Shuley School of Law to give voice to the voiceless, to be able to advocate strongly, effectively, and with a lot of compassion for those who are voiceless in society. So to me, the Weldon tradition is a combination of equipping students with the intelligence uh, and the instruments that go along with having a law degree, but also character. Um, character is built by <laughs> attending three years of study at the law school. <laughs> I've always been strongly connected to my community, and one has to look at the way I was raised. Um, in Nova Scotia, we have a lot of historical black communities. I was raised in one of those historical and segregated communities. Attended a segregated school, had very devoted parents, devoted teachers, uh, and the church played a big part in my life as well. So when I was in university uh, at the Schulich School of Law, um, there were many people in my community that were hoping I would succeed in obtaining my law degree. For me, on a daily basis, uh, being appointed to the family court was huge, uh, not just for me personally, but for my community. And being the first female, uh, black female, on the judiciary in Canada was a momentous uh, step uh, for our community. So I'm very mindful of that as a, an accomplishment. But on a daily basis, this again harkens back to serving the public, uh, helping the children that come before the family court, helping the families. I've always been mindful of my place in history and I hope through being on the bench for th over 33 years, I've been able to inspire some of the young black girls, girls, but black girls in particular, to take a step in the right direction in terms of their educational goals. I say, dare to be yourself, be authentic, and remember, the, a degree from the Schulich School of Law is currency, and it's currency that will be very valuable as you forge ahead and create a pathway for a successful life. 
And I've always believed this, and this harkens back to Dr. Martin Luther King. Everybody can be great in this world because everybody can serve. Uh, Dr. Martin Luther King believed that, and I, I believe that, and this is one of the key underpinnings of being part of the Weldon tradition.